Hi guys, welcome back to Unsolved with Barb. So, Brandon Isabel was in court today. Um, he's the one that was accused of killing um, his girlfriend, 27, and his two-day-old baby girl. So, today uh, it goes, Brandon Isabel, who was the father of missing newborn baby, appeared in court today, Monday, for allegedly killing his newborn daughter and the mother of his child. Isabel uh, pleaded not guilty before the judge. The judge announced in court that the hearing would be reset for February 15th. Um, it goes on to say, MD, MPD said Danielle Hoyle, 27, was found shot dead in the vehicle on February 1st with her two-day-old baby, Kennedy, who is nowhere to be found. Officers found an abandoned car seat at the Walmart in Whitehaven, which was later confirmed by family members to be Kennedy's. Um, so he's pleaded guilty after court. Hoyle's mother said she and Isabel made eye contact during the court hearing. He looked me dead in the eyes. He knows who I am, she said. This would have never have. This would have never happened if, I, if he had not come back. He should have just stayed gone. Hoyle's mother also said Isabel spent time with Kennedy before she went missing. He got to hold her and everything, she said. How could you kill something that's part of you? If you didn't want her, you should have just say, stayed gone. I never thought I would have to bury one of my kids. Um... What else does it say here? Um, Isabel admitted to killing Hoyle and throwing Kennedy into the water at the Upper Mud Island boat ramp before throwing their murder weapon into the Mississippi River in Wolf River Delta. Um, he also admitted to luring Hoyle to the area of Levi, Levi and Sed Sedwick and shooting her according to court documents. Um, Isabel is being charged with two counts of first-degree murder, murder in the perpetration of aggravated kidnapping and tampering, fabricating evidence. The body of the newborn baby, Kennedy, has not been found.